hey Siri, what's the temperature? It's about 34 degrees outside. Whew. So therefore, no way am I going to do a video outside today. But it is the 15th of April 2022. Now you may hear some banging noise. And that banging noise is my lovely girlfriend Sophie is cooking some fish and banging some fish, something like that, against the floor so Tokyo can have some lovely fish. I presume you want to go and see so going to do that at the end of the video right let's get on with it it's baking hot today oh lordy lord I have a video that I have on my other channel but I'm going to put it into this channel as well of the lockdown in China but you're going to get it exclusively here first and then tomorrow my time it's going to be on the other channel. So you can check my other channels out all on the links below and you can join me on Messenger now as well where I'm going to post some of the videos. Everything, all the links are in the description below. Now the levels I'm going to show you in a minute have gone down but this is April and there have been some floods already in China. How do I know about this? Because some people would have to go for their COVID tests I could say ankle high in water. Now I'm not too sure where this place is, so you can say yes, the floods have already started in China officially because you can see it on, I think it's on the lockdown somewhere where they, they're the only time they're allowed out is to go for the COVID test or the COVID-19 test. So these levels are still around about 164, 165. The inflows have increased quite a lot. I'll show you that a little bit later on. And you start to wonder if they need these levels down, which should be now, and they're not, and it rains a bucket load, are these sluice gates? Do the sluice gates have some serious, and I mean some serious problems? Because ever since the dawn of history, Ever since the dawn of time with the Three Gorges, the levels have always been at 145 at the beginning of the rainy season. But now we're at 164. You can see the inflow and the outflow has increased dramatically. Again, a little bit later on. In fact, instead of talking about it, let's show you right now. Here are the levels of the Three Gorges Reservoir. Here are the levels of Chongqing, and you can also see the inflow and the outflow looks a little bit like this. So let's have a look at the weather for you and see how the rain is around central China, the Yangtze Delta, the Three Gorges. The hand is where the Three Gorges Dam is. And over the next minute or so, you would have some music there for you.
So I haven't done a live stream today. I'm, what have I done over the last couple of days is a lot live stream of what you can see on Twitter. So it makes it nice and easy for you. What's happening in China? All you need to do if you want to go to Twitter or set up a Twitter account and just type in China, hit videos and you can see real pictures from real citizens of China of what the lockdown is like. And it feels like the people have had enough and they are breaking away from their quarantine, their lockdown, and saying, because they want food. And the authorities have got too much to handle. And they are delivering some food, but they're not delivering it to all 25 million. This is not just in Shanghai in China, that is in 22 other cities. In fact, I was speaking to someone today in Harbin, in the northeast of China. Their university is on lockdown. They can go around the university, but they can't leave the university because the city there or parts of the city are on lockdown. Something that the media, the Chinese media, hasn't done, but I can find out for you. So this is the video of what China can be like with the um, lockdown because of the zero tolerance policy in the People's Republic of China. It is not Xi's Republic. Here it is.
Okay, a little bit earlier on, you may have heard some knocking while I was making the intro to this video, and it was girlfriend Soapy making some fish, or hammering some fish basically on the floor so Tokyo can eat it. This is dried salty fish, which she really loves. And I went downstairs to investigate what was going on. So for the King Tokyo fans and Soapy fans, here they are downstairs in the kitchen. Are you hungry, Toki? <laughs> hungry. Look, it's here. Look. Wait, it's hot. Uh, look. Oh, sorry? Mm -hmm. mm. So that's what the banging noise was. And that brings us to a close for today. Not a very long video, I'm afraid, today because not much information is coming out or I haven't done a lot of research. Many thanks to all the new subscribers. A warm welcome to you guys especially. Do check the regular subscribers that you have resubscribed because sometimes you get unsubscribed. Don't ask me the reason why. Always do that thumbs up. Share this with your friends. Check it out on Messenger. All the information, hopefully, is hopefully is in the description below just follow the links and they should click automatically and a big shout out to all my members who are on patreon and also the members of my channel here thank you so much for devoting your time for watching and letting me or letting me to have a beer now and again those who support me financially on the channel be good be well god bless thank you so much have a awesome day wherever you are boy it is hot.